Hi there, delighted to say that this week on Being Human, my guest is Raj Sisodia. He is the co-founder of Conscious Capitalism, and, and the book of that name has been, was a huge inspiration for me when I first read it several years ago. He's back with a new book, The Healing Organisation, and that's the main focus of, of our conversation. What I got most from our talk uh, was this idea of balancing energies. So for a long time, I've had this conception that we somehow need to feminise the workplace, that we need to bring uh, more, more feminine energy into the way that we operate, uh, create more nurturing environments. And, and Raj certainly agrees with that, but he's, he's saying something very important about masculine energy, that we must, of course, retain this masculine energy, this this focus on, on goals, this achievement orientation is, is very important uh, for success in business, uh, but a mature masculine energy. And, and the way I see that is not a sort of scorched earth uh, masculine drive, um, but one that uh, allows um, for accommodation of, of these other, other value sets. And so he, he sees it as balancing actually four energies. Uh, and that's the route to creating sustainable businesses and, and healing organisations, as he describes them. The first is yeah, the masculine energy. We, we need that. Uh, a feminine nurturing energy. A child energy. Uh, ability to be playful, to seek joy in all that we do. Uh, to come at problems from a naive perspective. And then fourthly, elder energy. Uh, wisdom uh, concern for purpose, uh, a question of our, our legacy in maybe seven generations from now. This, this really important idea of ben balancing those four energies struck me. Perhaps it will resonate with you. Uh, we're, the conversation is out this Friday. Roger Sodia, the topic of the healing organisation.